Hey y'all, Farmer Dre back at it. Today I am standing in our uh, four rows of tomato plants we planted out in the field. Yesterday, we laid down the plastic and uh, we planted the tomatoes. I filmed a few clips of that, I'm gonna show you guys there. But today what I'm doing is I gotta run the irrigation. And since uh, we don't have the the irrigation, the main header line hooked up yet, I'm, I uh, made an invention here where we got the generator and then the pump. So we're watering the first line here. I'm gonna show you guys a quick roll here. The drip tape's right here, it's solid. It's working up and down, the water's leaking out of it. So I gotta do all four lines. We're gonna irrigate about 250 gallons per row. And then we will uh, continue, we got four rows to do here. So you guys stay tuned. If you guys haven't already, go ahead, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, like this video. If you guys have any questions, comments, anything like that, leave them down in the description box below. If you guys haven't already, go ahead and hit that bell, notification bell. Let me, uh, so I can, you guys can be notified whenever I do post a video. And I wanna say, uh, it's gonna be a hot day, but we're gonna irrigate the tomatoes. So what we have here is our uh, generator, then a third horsepower pump down thing pumping up the water. We got a reducer from a one inch to three quarter, running down the line into the connection here. I just got some hose clamp clamped it off, and it's running the irrigation. As you guys can see, it's already starting to puddle up in there. So the water is a rolling. Tomatoes are being watered. So. Just a time of waiting now. I might just leave the skid steer here and everything. We'll come back whenever it's done here again to go refill the tank. So here we go. Laying more plastic. These are probably gonna be full of tomatoes. So Where we are, transplanting tomatoes. Get these just shoved in there, just like that. Tomato planting to the max. Jib tape again. Smashing the jib tape. No, we need a go to put it up there. We just got done transplanting all these tomatoes. And well it's next to do probably tomorrow. I cannot wait on these. I mean if I if I lack on these, they're not gonna be make the most production. Come through, put posts every four plants, stake them up, tie them up. And what we're planning on doing here is a you pick vegetable patch, you pick tomatoes. Customers come out to the farm and pick their own produce. So, gotta come through, stake them up, and uh, it's gonna be fun. So, now I am uh, filling up this vegetable bed. We're gonna lay more plastic, and then I am going to, uh, we're gonna transplant all of, all of our peppers. Cucumbers and squashes, so just more tilling. Go ahead and start laying down the plastic. We're doing the white plastic again, and uh, we can get it done. So, laying down more plastic. So started laying plastic again. The soil's getting worked up a whole lot better now compared to yesterday. I quit tillering there, but we're gonna start laying as much as we can. We got more drip tape and everything. So, so far it's running smoothly. We're gonna plant most more tomatoes and start with the peppers. And then we got a lot of cucumbers, squashes, and all kinds of other stuff going in here too. So at the end, I think we'll have close to about a half acre of vegetables here. So, yep, yep. Working our on row number four now. Got to hold here and just hold the drip tape. 
It's getting real tight under there. So row number four, we're gonna see how many rows we get done before we run out of material. And once we run out of material, start transplanting. White plastic, checking the beds here. Got a solid bed. We're good. So a quick little update here. We already laid down six rows and then I just got done tillering that right there. So we're gonna go ahead and continue laying down the plastic mulch and wait until the sun kind of goes down because this is the worst time of the day to plant because the sun is beating down and it's so hot. And if you plant stuff, stuff will just start wilting. So we're just gonna wait until you know, the sun goes down a little more and finish planting here. So, but we're, we can lay down the plastic as much as we want. So the irrigation is still running there and uh, we're gonna finish laying and then we're gonna start planting. But first I got, we got to fix our water house this past winter. Uh, that red barn there or that whatever you want to call it. There's kind of, we just call it the water house. It, some of the pipes in it busted. I, I did put a little heater in there, but apparently it didn't work right. So we got to fix that, make sure the irrigation is ready to go, and then start transplanting. They say if you get done planting at 12 o'clock, the irrigation needs to kick on at, you know, 12.01. So the irrigation system needs to be up and ready to go before you even get done planting. But, you know, those tomato plants, we just had time yesterday, so we just finished them. That's why I'm irrigating there with them. So we're going to... Got to finish fi fix the water house, but first we're going to finish laying plastic here. So, so this was our last bit of the drip tape. Now we have 2,000 feet of uh, vegetables under plastic. So, so last thing now we got to come through with the transplanter. We might try to fix our well first, and then we'll see what happens. So the 90 there was popped. Fix that one up. Turn on the water, and this whole pipe blew open. So, got to put this valve here. Spigot. On there with the reducer in my hand here with the two one inch nine one inch and then we'll see if it works so we are going to go ahead and give her to go isaac just bring more tools per rent hot per rent per rent push up against count cart push up against the building dude make sure you push the building down there she is <clears throat> there right, it clean is. her up primer up nice and clean put her in 90. get the primer in there Dogs on the dying. <laughs> They're chasing the fall there. Who needs a plumber when you got Farmer Dre? Or Farmer Val? <laughs> we got Kimberly. <laughs> there we go. Dude, sit down. What do you mean it's laid out? Because it's fresh. Hold it. There you go. Let me shut it. Yep. Okay. So we have to re okay. adjust this one. Here, and cut it again from the new 90. Cut it from. No, we need that part. So okay. I'm going to cut this like right here. Okay. The blade ripped. Really? Go get me a new blade. Where's the folder? You go straight up. Make sure it's straight, bro. It is. All right. Alright, please pipe. The fuck of first call pull out the switch. Alright, coupling. Here. Saws off first. Right there. Hey, hold it, man. Need your help here. Step in. Pick up. Pick up. Down. There you go. Okay, good. Sit. Let it dry. We got it direct out of the well. Going. Should work. Works. 
we got the water we are redneck engineering all hooked up not a leak and running smoothly we are ready to start planting we got the tomato plants we got eggplant we got all kinds of cucumber squashes zucchinis a lot more cucumbers got some spaghetti squash all kinds of stuff we're I just turned on this irrigation pipe now. I'm going to run down to the end, clog it up, and then we'll get to planting. Okay, you go faster, bro, faster. All the way in, all the way in. Foot stuck, man. Man. You, you can't just pick up plastic. Jeez. so it is now dark we just got done planting we have 2,000 feet in total here there's one two three four five 15 rows of vegetables we just got done planting all of them it is uh 9 30 at night these are your peppers we got sweet peppers bell peppers we got plant a bunch of cucumbers with some watermelons all kinds of good stuff so we got close to about 1,200 plants in total of six, uh, 2,000 feet of uh, vegetables under plastic here. So, we got a lot of eggplant we planted, zucchini, squashes, all kinds of stuff here. So, just got done planting them. We got, you know, we just planted what three, four, it was close to 600 plants in like half hour. So, it goes pretty quick once you start moving. But until you get started, that takes a long time. These are the cucumbers here. And more tomatoes and all kinds of good stuff. So real quick, I want to show you guys our irrigation system for now. We got the hose from the water house coming in. And what I did here is we got the, the valve. And then I just got a piece of uh, the header hose. And then I just got a female adapter of the wire there. And just connect the hose to that. Just let it run. And whenever we, now since all the rows are planted, I'm going to come through with the header hose to the main with every single valve. Every spigot and every single row just turn on the one main line and then we will um, water all the lines at once. But for right now, I water these five rows of tomatoes uh, today and then I'm going to come tomorrow and water the rest of them so they could uh, be good to go. Alrighty guys, I want to say uh, thanks for watching up to this point. We did get all our vegetables planted. We have a little bit more inside the greenhouse there, but we're going to have to lay some more plastic down and find some more room for them. But overall, it looks pretty good. My brother Val just came in with the gate with the LED bar. It's, uh, it's, I mean, it's, it's been a long time. It is June, you know, 4th or 5th today. This should have been done, you know, middle of May, but it is what it is. We just got done doing it today. The weather finally dried up. We're supposed to get, we're supposed to get a lot more rain, you know, coming up here, uh, probably this week. Tomorrow and Friday, we're supposed to get a lot more rain, and then, um, it was supposed to dry up for a little bit, and then we'll plant the blackberries and all kinds of, you know, all the, do all the kinds of work. Still got to finish the high density apple. So if you guys haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Like this video. If you guys have any questions, comments, anything, leave them down in the description box below. Don't forget to hit that bell notification bell. And that's pretty much it for today. We just planted, you know, close to 1,200 uh, vegetables. You know, it's 2,000 feet of uh, vegetables under plastic. 
and you know got that done it needed to be done so now it's done i can sleep a little better now so i want to say thanks for watching you guys have a good day and we'll see you next time